This year, Italy will grow at its highest rate since 2010, exceeded only three times in the 2000s. There are a number of tailwinds. International trade is strong, the European economy is going well, the ECB will maintain a very accommodative monetary policy for a while. Can we keep up this pace going forward, perhaps reaching the level of our European partners, who are growing faster than we are, or we will soon find ourselves out of breath and need to slow down, especially if the tailwinds will fade? Looking at the numbers, it seems that we do not have the ability to keep up this pace. Average productivity has been stagnating since 2000, and unless a positive shock occurs, the potential growth rate of our economy is still very low. However, higher productivity growth is possible, not so much with temporary incentives such as fiscal expansions, although helpful in difficult times, but with policies supporting investments, innovation, education and training, benefiting businesses that grow and produce rather than those that profit from rent-seeking positions. Some reasons for optimism exist. Also in Italy, foreign demand and fiscal incentives are creating an expansionary cycle of capital and IT investments, productivity and potential growth can only benefit from this. So, in 2018, the favorable tailwinds will allow GDP to grow at 1.5%. It is time now to gather together all the available resources to increase potential growth.